you can see the electromagnetic field all around it. The red part, the glow, that's an electromagnetic field. I'm just gonna go back, let it come on. Uh, it went the wrong way now. I'll see if it's gonna come in. It went backwards. It's still moving backwards. I'm not touching the camera now. I, I thought I was gonna intercept it, but it went the other way. I have to move the camera. It went the wrong way. It's still going the wrong way. I gotta move the camera. Okay, now it's going the right way. Okay, you can really see the electromagnetic field, that red band all around it. It's very prominent tonight. But no wonder, look how bright it is and everything. There's a big orb right there, a cluster I mean. Let me just put it so that it doesn't move out of the way. Okay, that right there on the right hand side, that's a big cluster. I just want to move it so you can see it. Too far. Okay, there. There's lots of clusters right there along the edge. You can see what's making that red glow. It's all these orbs going really fast all around. See how it's moving backwards now? It doesn't want you to see that. Yeah. Can't beat gravity. Look at all the look at all those big saucers. Right there, the orb looking things, those are all saucers. Look at them all. Right there. Look how fast it's moving up now. It doesn't want to show them. But it can't beat gravity, it's going to pull it down. The only way it can do it is if it powers up and uh, escapes it all together, but not in a hover like this. At low power, it stands no chance. Look, look at the movement. They're not moving the camera at all. That's that's the moon hologram moving. And those are all saucers right there at the edge. Here, let's see them up close. Too bad they're glowing. Sometimes they're black and you can see them, but the whole thing is powered up. And those are not craters, by the way. They're saucers. Right on the, on the surface. Here, here's one. Right there. Yeah, that one's hovering over, over the surface. Look at this over here. Look how many. Every time I set it, it moves. Look at all of those. Look at it jump. I'm not touching the camera. Look at that jump. And look at all the orbs. They're all saucers. Okay, all the ones there. They're all saucers. You can see them. They're, they're hovering. And look at the ones shooting off into the, into the atmosphere. This is all happening right here above my head, maybe a couple of kilometers, not much more. Look at that thing jump, whoa. Hold on, I gotta bring it back. Okay, look at them all. You see? They're backwards, forwards, sideways, any way you want, but it's moving like crazy all over. <laughs> Look, it moved right off the screen in the wrong direction as well. So, I have no doubt that this is not the moon. 
This is uh, a spaceship with a lot of little ships all over it. That's an alien craft and all of these are alien saucers right there. Look how fast it moves out of the way every time I want to show something. And there. And look at them all on the surface. It's just too bright. But if you look closely, you can make some of them out. The whole thing is packed with saucers. It's a spherical sort of. Not quite a sphere, but close enough. And inside of that hologram are all saucers. A whole lot of them. Thousands and thousands. Maybe, maybe a million. I don't know how many. Maybe a few million. But there's a lot. And I see them take off and land all the time. Look at them all. And they're right over our heads. And look at the orbs making that uh, uh, red band all around the electromagnetic field. Okay, so they have a force field on it. Only they can go in and out but nothing else. Look, it's going backwards. Look at this, how much it jumped. Just look at the movement. Look, it's going backwards, now it's going up, now it's going down. It's still going backwards. And it's pretty unbelievable, the things that it's doing. It's doing nothing right. If it were our moon, it wouldn't be doing any of these things. Look at all those orbs. Now these are all ships, but the ships are living ships. They're composed of uh, all these organisms. So when you have a cluster, you have a ship. And the moon hologram is just one big cluster and one big ship and it's alien and those are alien beings and alien entities and alien organisms and they're all over this planet that we call our home earth I'm talking about and look you can't even hold a hover look at all those in the air right there they're being shot out from from the hologram now you can get a good look how fast they are those are all being shot off the hologram into, uh, into the atmosphere. Just look at them. Huh? It didn't want me to show that, that's for sure. Just look at them. Yeah, move it. Just look at how many ores are right there on the edge. They're the ones shooting off. The, the hologram, the ones right on the edge. But they don't have to be on the edge to shoot off. They can shoot off from anywhere. But those either just came in or they're just about to leave. Look at this thing jumping around. I wanted to show I wanted to show that one over here. Look at the size of it. That's a couple of hundred miles. That one there in the lower right corner. That's how big that is, a couple hundred miles. And look at the ones next to it, they're big too. Look at them over here on top. This is a battle station. That's all it can be. It can't be anything else. It's a battle station. Too bad it's an alien battle station and not ours. Just look at that thing going back and forth and the movement it's having. And, and look at that electromagnetic field. And look at on top, right in the center. That's a big saucer. 
Don't, don't mistake it for a mountain or a crater. That's a big saucer. This whole part is too bright. I can't show anything. Maybe down here. You can see them down here. Right there on the edge. Between the red part and the yellow part. They're all saucers. Right there. That whole line from the top to the bottom uh, along the red line between the red and the yellow that's all saucers it's just so bright that they're hard to see but they're all saucers and they're going all the way up look all along the edge all along the edge right there so that side must be the outgoing ones and the other side or the back of it must be the incoming ones because they can't have them crash into each other. They have to have one side go out, another side come in. Just look at all of them there. Okay, so that's about all I can uh, show. It's, I'm at 31 minutes. I just want to get the movement again. See how it's moving. If it's still erratic. Okay, it doesn't seem to be moving as much right now. Let's see. Ah, there it goes. I was just gonna say, it looks like they have their hover under control, but it just jerked. There it goes. Okay, they're having a lot of problems tonight maintaining that hover. It's not going to be happening. Okay, so that's not our moon. Uh, it, it can't even come close. And uh, that's not a natural satellite. And it's so bright that uh, our moon was never like that. So bright. I've taken enough videos and photos of it that I can tell you that it was never so bright. And last night it was even brighter. It was twice as bright at least uh, than it is now. But even today it's so bright that it's just too much. Look, look how bright that is. And that's nowhere close to how bright it was uh, yesterday. Look at all those uh, large clusters there and uh, in the center left to the left and uh, those are all ships every one of them they can all fly and these are not structures that are on solid ground the whole thing is not solid the whole thing is a, is a ship but these are just the smaller ones that uh, go and do their business uh, in different places but uh, by small I don't mean uh, in meters I mean in, in uh, kilometers that's how big those things are in kilometers so they they got to be measured in kilometers how large those ships are not in meters and you can see just how many there are look let's see if I can get them up close these large ones Hey, look how many there are. So those can be measured in kilometers. 
because that's how large they are. They're not measured in meters, that's for sure. Just look at the, their size in comparison to the entire structure, and, and they're huge. Okay, it's almost 36 minutes. I don't think anybody will watch it if it's any longer. So here it is. One more time. Let's see this part. Okay, those are big too. Right there. Okay. And this structure there, in the middle, is new. That wasn't there before. And I don't know what that symbolizes. But it looks almost like a number nine. It could be a number seven with the line through it. But anyway, that's the shape it has. And these ones over here. You can get a closer look at uh, look at this now it's moving back the other way it doesn't want me to see that side at all but this is from more uh, farther away look at that thing sticking off right from it two two things sticking up the one on the right hand bottom corner and the one on the right hand top both of those things are uh, just uh, rods, uh, they're a pile of oars lined up in a straight line uh, and they're attached one next to each other in a line. So that's how they make those. Those are not uh, actual structures, they're just uh, oar clusters back to back in a straight line. There's the field, did you see the color change? Uh, that's the field. Uh, I caught it right at the right time. Now I can't. Okay, anyway, that's one of them, the, the tall structures, but that's just a cluster of orbs, and the other one is right there next to it. So those are miles or kilometers up in the air from the surface of the hologram. But what they are, are just a bunch of orb clusters or orb ships lined up like beads on a string and they're pointing uh, straight and that's called a rod because that's what rods are. A bunch of them together like that in a line and they look like a rod. Okay, so there's how bright it is. I'm at 39 minutes now, I overdid it. Oh, at 40, I'm going to stop. So that's how bright it is, and that's twice as bright. Uh, maybe three times as bright as normal, but only half as bright as yesterday. So our moon was never that bright. Not like that. It didn't glow from inside out. So one more trip across to check uh, the motion, and then that's it. I want to take this time out to thank everyone who watches this video. I appreciate it. Thank you very much. Okay, 40 minutes, that's it.